it's Brad here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we have another free OC, but this one is a little bit more complex than my other ones. This OC, I was actually so inspired, I went and made two different morphs, but you'll have to watch till the end of the video to see the second morph and why they have two morphs. But first, I just want to explain where I get the idea from. On Twitter, there's actually an account called Generator Claw Bot, and they uh, randomly generate warrior cat names and then descriptions. So this is Blutter Butterfly Bright, a thin jet colored cat with eyes the color of the forest and taupe brown spots on their pelt. They are known as a confident kitty pet and a clumsy doctor. So the video is sped up in the background. That's because sometimes I go back and forth on like what I want to do for designs because that's kind of how I work on like warrior cat morph making is just like trying something and being like, do I like that? No. Okay, then I'm gonna do this. <laughs> I just had to use the eye spot because it's truly one of the coolest markings. I know everyone is using them now and that's fine. I think that we can all have it. I don't know, I support it. And another thing I really wanted with this kitty pet was to have a matching bow with the collar because like, I just think he was just like a nice little kitty pet like maybe he didn't really love the bow and collar but he was like that's ah, fine this is like what I know I grew up in but maybe always eat like gently looked outside or like maybe what I th actually think was that he would get into fights um, with other like kitty pets in the yard he would just kind of be the more like territorial one but he learned how to heal his own wounds because of that and so that's where I think um, his backstory comes in where he started out as a kitty pet and then either he left on his own or maybe he met like another clan I'm thinking shadow clan but honestly this like plot could work for any roleplay server you know like you could adapt it to whatever um, fits what how many people are in the server and like what clan if that makes sense but so I think he's here and then either like a clan comes is like we need a messing cat or he's like going out and just exploring and then eventually I think he starts to become like a part of a clan and so I was like wouldn't it be fun if I made two different morphs that way people could either start him off as a warrior and have his backstory that he was a kitty pet and, or they could start with him as a kitty pet and like have this like the second morph to transition to and so what I thought is that maybe after being in the wild for a while his fur it wasn't being brushed anymore so he just gets like really really fluffy everywhere and um, he gets a few more scars because either so butterfly bright I think bright could be because he's really smart or cunning and I was also kind of debating if he started as a warrior and then got like wounded and then maybe decided to be more just like a medical doctor like he wanted to help people like on the fields of war or something like that or if he just like joined because he was really good at healing and but maybe still was like I want to be in the middle of like the battle and stuff because I care about my like my comrades and maybe he didn't like have any sort of like other kitty pets around in his house and so he just fought with like the neighbors but finally has a sense of belonging I kind of do want to role play with this character so if you see a long role play in the future with them it's because I was really inspired, but I would also love to hear if any of you guys use this character or what y'all's role plays are like, because I know every, even if like 10 people had the same character with the same backstory, if we were all in different servers, all of the stories would be different. And honestly, that's like a little challenge I've been wanting to try is like me and a few friends all have the same character, same backstory, but we just have separate role plays and see how it goes. Um, we've done some stuff similar before and it was really fun, but all right. I'm gonna stop rambling. Uh, feel free to slow any of this down or screenshot it. You can use this OC, the design, and stuff like that. I won't be able to physically give the morph because uh, I've tried in the past and it's really chaotic, but feel free to copy. It was pretty easy to make, or even just something similar or inspired. You know, I just really like to kind of like help inspire people. So if you like this video, please hit subscribe. It really helps the channel out and helps me know like what you guys want to see more of. Oh my gosh, I forgot that these other two cats, I was trying to take like a screenshot for the thumbnail. It's fine, hello other cats. <laughs> but okay, bye guys.